Hi, I'm Anna Sinclair. I'm the CEO and founder of Total Mom Inc. We are here at Guerlain Spa and Hotel X in downtown Toronto. I often come here to unwind, get some work done, and get a little bit of R&R. And it's beautiful here. It's a mix of wellness, uh, rejuvenation, and uh, you can get a little bit of work done. So when I started Total Mom Inc, I actually didn't really know I was going into entrepreneurship. I was an actress, I was a singer, I was signed to Universal, I was on the Disney Channel. So I was just like living my life and then all of a sudden when I was at the height of my career, I almost got this major record deal in the US. I lost it because I was pregnant and at that time it wasn't really that woman empowerment era. We weren't really encouraged to follow our career passions as a new mom and I lost lost the deal and found myself at a local baby show in Toronto where new moms go just to shop. At that time I felt so depleted as a woman, as a career woman. I was excited about motherhood but I really was just looking at all this baby stuff and I thought, oh my gosh, what is out there for women like me that want to have that holistic support system, want more meaningful support systems in her life? And in came the Total Mom Show. The company really started off as a festival called the Total Mom Show. Now it's this empire, it's this brand um, we host pitch competitions, business summits, online education programs. We give grants to diverse women entrepreneurs. It really has legs and arms of its own now. It really just started from a need. So I'm not a big fan of the term work-life balance, all those things. I find that being a human, being a woman, living a life, it's always going to be a juggling act and I feel like that need to find the balance is so tricky and almost alienating. At Total Mom, like one of our biggest pillars is alignment. And so instead of calling it balance or work-life balance, we call it getting in and out of alignment. And we make it so natural and normal to do by talking about it. Some of the things that I found early days that really brought a lot of success to me when I was juggling all of those balls was to create the space for people to come in and support and ask and actually like think beyond, I can't afford a nanny or I can't afford a babysitter, but like really think how can I, what would I need to do to do that, who can I ask and get those people involved, almost like create a team around you. I think moms have this huge expectation to do it all, be it all, and we just need this like reminder that there's a team behind being a mom and a, and a founder and a CEO. So embrace that team and bring on as many people as you can. At the beginning of the journey, I didn't really think about finances. I didn't really go past that initial passion of what I wanted to grow. So with the festival, I was thinking something was going to cost 20 grand and it actually cost 120 grand. One of the things that can hold us back as founders is thinking that we know it all or, or that we know where we're going. And so mentorship and advisory is so key to the entire picture. It's so important to grow a community um, and it's important to get your community involved and like bring value, like truly bring value. Don't think about the product or service that you're selling only, but the people that you're serving as if you were that person themselves. I had to face this whole realization that I didn't really know what I was doing for like the first three years. I was the bottleneck to the company, I was the bottleneck to the whole project and I didn't even realize it. Things were getting tough and I ended up buying my business partner out and not paying myself for like two and a half years and that was a very low point, I would say. You put your blood, sweat and tears into, into the business and you know you need a break, but you know that if you walk away, you could lose it all. So the lesson that I've been really trying to learn is to be more committed but less attached, which is still very, very hard. <laughs> You need to kind of go back to the basics of what your passions and gifts are. I really don't think that entrepreneurship is for the faint-hearted and I don't think it's for people who just want to get rich. It takes a long time. There's a lot of obstacles and barriers and things to overcome as a founder and as an entrepreneur. And you need a lot of grit, you need a lot of risk, uh, tenacity, and at the end of the day, if you don't wake up and go to sleep loving it, whether you get paid or not, it's definitely like an indication that that's not the right thing for you. Don't do it for the money, don't do it for the fame, do it because you truly want to wake up doing that.
Total Mom been busy doing Canada's Total Mom Pitch. We are launching a online school and subscription membership for founders juggling motherhood and business. One of the most exciting projects that kind of spawned off of Total Mom was the Canadian Women Entrepreneur Industry Gala. And this gala really brings together influencers, media, uh, top C-suite executives, professional women, uh, founders and entrepreneurs all together to access connections. Because funding has always been such an issue for women and it continues to be so, we wanted to find, find some of the most powerful people and bring them all together and, and try to make things happen. That is just like one of the most exciting pieces and that we're going into our second year um, and that's going to be happening later in the city um, in May. We're looking at launching a venture fund and this would be a fund that helps fund women entrepreneurs that are mothers that are not able to get traditional loans from the bank. We don't want women going and getting predatory loans. We want them coming to Total Mom and being seen and heard and supported and funded. So that's a really big undertaking. It's really exciting. Investing in women lights me up. And then, yeah, we're bringing back the Total Mom show across Canada. So that's going to be a really fun and large undertaking. And yeah, just hopefully growing the team and seeing what else we could bring to the table. Well, thanks for joining me out of office today. I'm Anna Sinclair, founder and CEO of Total Mom Inc. You can follow me on Instagram and all the social platforms, annasinclair.ca. And that's also my website. Pretty smart, right? Okay, we're going to go get some R&R &R and hang out. And have some treats. And have some treats too. Okay, bye!